वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव वर्ल्ड फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो टू ऑनवर्ड वी आर स्टार्टिंग चैप्टर टू एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बी सॉल्विंग लर्निंग असेसमेंट ई टू पॉइंट वन वाइल सॉल्विंग दिस प्रॉब्लम वी विल बी यूजिंग ओम्स ला बेसिक इक्वेशन ऑफ ओम्स ला इज वी इक्वल टू आई मल्टीप्लाई बाई आर हेयर वी इज वोल्टेज आई इज करंट एंड आर इज द रेजिस्टेंस एंड इलेक्ट्रिकल पावर डेट इज द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ वोल्टेज एंड करंट we also will be using passive sign convention theory according to this theory elements with negative power will be considered as power supplier and elements with positive power will be considered as power absorber read the scenario learning assessment 2.1 part a calculate current and absorbed power by resistance in given below figure this is the figure and we have to calculate current i and power absorbed by this resistance so without wasting time let's proceed towards the solution first we will mark polarity symbols across the resistance these symbols are taken with the reference of these voltage now we will calculate the value of i through the circuit and for the calculation of i we will use ohms law which is v equal to i multiplied by r from this equation we can calculate i because voltage and resistance are given so the value of i will be v divided by r enter the value of voltage and resistance into the equation and calculate current that is 0.3 milliampere now we have calculated current through this resistance and voltage across this resistance which are 12 volt so we can calculate the power of this resistance using the power formula that is the product of voltage and current we know the value of voltage and current enter the values of voltage and current into the equation here we have taken current with positive sign because this current is entering from positive terminal and leaving from negative terminal so this current will be taken with positive sign and the power of resistance will be 3.6 milliwatt and because of positive sign this power is being absorbed by this 40 kilo ohm resistor now move to the next part part b calculate voltage of current source and power supplied by current source in given below figure in this circuit resistance is given current through this resistance is given so we can use ohms law to calculate voltage across this resistance and because of parallel connection these same voltages will be appearing across this current source before starting the solution we will mark polarity symbols across this resistance this current is entering from this terminal of resistance so it will be taken with positive sign and leaving from this terminal so this terminal will be taken with negative sign basic equation of ohms law is v equal to i multiplied by r we know the value of current and resistance place the values into the equation and calculate voltage that is 3.6 volt this voltage of resistance are also appearing across this constant current source because of parallel connection so the value of vs will also be 3.6 volt now calculate the power of this constant current source using basic formula of power that is the product of voltage and current we know the value of voltage across this element and current through this element we can calculate its power place the values of voltage and current here current is entering from negative terminal of this constant current source and leaving from positive terminal so this current will be taken with minus sign so the power of constant current source will be minus 2.16 milliwatt this minus is indicating that power is being supplied through this constant current source of 2.16 milliwatt so this was learning assessment 2.1 thank you see you again in next video